What's good, what up? It's your boy Sam Ant here at Viral Hip Hop News. Do me a favor, family, before we get started with the content, y'all know what to do. Go up top and hit that like button. All right, this brother right here need no introduction, but if you don't know who he is, it's a young MC by the name of Joyner Lucas, one of the top lyricists and MCs in the game today. Will be in the game for a long, long time, I assure you of that. Has been in the public eye definitely recently. Dropping that highly publicized video, amazing video, I Am Not A Racist. Doing numbers upon numbers on YouTube. If you haven't seen it, go check that out. Then he also did a remix of Lil Pump's Gucci Gang where he annihilated his ass, justifiably so. And now he went on Hot 97 and went on in a couple more people. Now, during a recent chat with the crew over at Ebro in the morning, Jorna took some shots at the likes of Lil Wayne, Future, and Lil Pump for his in mind glorifying the use of drugs when they spit bars. Quote Joyner, I've never been an artist promoting drugs. When you say those things, you're telling the listener to go do that shit. At the end of the day, I don't promote any artist. I don't care who the fuck you are. Wayne, it don't matter who you are. Anytime I hear artists promoting drugs, even Future with the Percocet, Molly Percocet, I don't like that shit. The discussion later shifted to his video for I'm not a racist. One that he has regrets about despite the negativity that has caught from viewers over the last little while. I can't make everybody happy. That was calculated as well. There would have been no resolution if I wouldn't have went as hard with the black cat as with the white man. I didn't want to do that because I wanted to create resolution. So I let the white man speak. I let him do his thing. This brother right here, like I said, his creativity is absolutely second to none. I think I got introduced to him by my man a couple years ago when I seen that Ross Cavacchione, and that shit blew me away, just to how he did it from the third person and how he just brought both, gave both perspectives to the situation. It was just amazing work, and I knew right then and there that this brother will be solidified in this game for a long, long time because if he had cre creativity like that, there was no stopping him. He would always know how to revolutionize and change the game. And then when you put his lyrics and his bars on top of it, hey, he's one of my favorites right now. There's no denying that, especially in the young right now, young game where you have a lot of your old and your young school going at each other because of the older school thinking that they took away a lot of the beauty and art from hip hop. Argue, it's definitely arguable, but that being said, Jordan Lucas is one of these brothers that they can breathe a, a breath of fresh air because that brother goes hard on his lyrics and he takes his game seriously and shout out to him. As far as him getting that Wayne future, I hear him and I agree with him. You couldn't agree more. If you're strongly about that situation, it shouldn't matter who the artist is. You can't condone any of that bullshit. I've been first to say on this platform that that Molly Percocet shit and all that nonsense is not cool. I don't promote that to the youth, the people listening to it. Whether you be old, young, if you have an ear and you're influenced by the people that you listen to and they're promoting that nonsense, I think that they personally deserve all the criticism that comes their way. If they man enough or woman enough to sit there and promote to the people to do this stuff that destroys and kills their body, then they deserve to hear the backlash and deserve to answer it to it, you know what I mean? But that's just my perspective. Y'all leave a comment in the comment section let me know what y'all think of Joyner Lucas and his comments made on Ebro in the Morning as well as the content. Also, right down there, you'll see in the description box links to our Twitter, as well as our homepage, Viral Hip Hop News. You'll also see a link to our brand new page, Viral Hip Hop Reloaded. Make sure you subscribe to all those movements. Really appreciate it. Always trying to keep it raw, real, uncut. Until next time, until next story, we're out of here. Peace. Oh, what a wonderful feeling. Fire. What a feeling to be one of What a feeling. What a feeling to What a feeling to be Oh, what a wonderful feeling. What a feeling to be one What a feeling to be. Yeah. The feeling's in the world